Hi guys, welcome back to In Case of Econ Struggles and welcome to our first Sunday Stata tip. If you're finding these videos helpful, make sure to like and subscribe. If there is a Stata tip or trick you'd like to see on these videos, make sure to comment below. Today, we are going to talk about a more efficient way to make a binary variable or a dummy variable using a data set that comes with Stata. So let's go ahead and get into it. We are going to be using this auto data and we are trying to generate this new binary variable called good car, which is going to be equal to one if this miles per gallon variable is greater than or equal to 25. So here's just a quick sum. We can see the average of miles per gallon is 21. So 25 seems like a good measure. Now, the normal way we're used to generating binary or dummy variables, we're going to say generate good car equals one if miles per gallon is greater than or equal to 25, and then replace that same variable equal to be zero if it's currently missing. Now, this is fine, but if I'm trying to make a lot of dummy variables, it's going to be a lot of code, and I would like to do this more efficiently. So the way I'm going to do this more efficiently is I'm going to say generate good car two equals and then open parentheses and I'm going to say miles per gallon is greater than or equal to 25. Notice that what this is going to say is Stata is going to test this condition and it's going to make good car two equal to one if this is true and zero if it is not true. So now let's go ahead and just run both. So I'll run both and then we can do a sum of good car and good car two. And we can see that everything is exactly the same. And if we go into the data editor, we can see again that the good car and good car two variable are exactly the same for every observation. So hopefully this gives you a more efficient way to generate those dummy variables. If this video was helpful, make sure to like and subscribe. And we'll see you next week for another Sunday Stata tip.